Hello you guys, welcome back to Vlogist. This will be what? Episode 3, I think? Um, <laughs> um, today is August 3rd, so yes, episode 3. Um, today is my mama's birthday, so I purposefully put on a full face of makeup so I do not allow myself to get too sad. <laughs> if you're new here, we lost her back in 2005. Um, Normally I don't film too much on Saturdays, so I guess technically I'm not really participating in Vlogist because I'm not really doing Saturdays and Sundays. This one you will see on Tuesday, but um, I figured I would uh, commit to this to force myself to be cheered up a little bit. <laughs> I have lots of cleaning to do. I am just sitting here. Um, going through and making my to-do list. Let me move all the candle and junk out of the way. Here is my to-do list for right now. Um, yeah, I need to sit down and order my glasses. <laughs> um, I have two pairs picked out, but I'm not 100% sold on them yet. So, yeah, I mean, and by the way, the fixed couch, that just means fix the pillows. <laughs> I was just jotting it down quickly and Ireland was in the bath and she kept calling me in there. So I was trying to do that quickly. Look at this. I ordered black rings for this. So it will be rose gold and black. These, I'm not a fan of regular gold, but these are just what I had. And the large one takes 11 and the regular one takes nine. So obviously all I had were sets of nine. <laughs> So there's two open ones right now. But look at this that I found too. I know I showed you this when I got it from Michael's that day. Home is the nicest word there is. So cute. This is the chores tab. Daily chores, weekly chores, monthly chores. Super cute. Yes, I know there is a shadow from the camera. The daily chores. I just put this in here, so. Then the weekly chores. And monthly chores. Kind of cracks me up because scrub kitchen sink and clean bathrooms is on the weekly thing. I don't know. I know I am a little obsessive compulsive when it comes to cleaning, so. <laughs> As I've been told by quite a few people about how I want my house to look, expect it to look, and how much I do daily. But those are things I do every day, so it's kind of weird that those are on the weekly, but whatever. It's there to remind me if it gets forgotten, I guess. But, um, yeah. I am going to go through my cleaning list here, and my husband said that he's going to try to finish work as quickly as he can so he can come home early. So I don't know how much of this I'm actually gonna be able to get done before he's able to come home. But he says he wants to go to one of the bigger cities close by and find something to do. He also has lost both of his parents so he knows how hard days like this is. <laughs> so he, he's really good about trying to like cheer me up and keep my mind off of it when days like this come around. Say hello, Mr. Jax. Say hello, Mr. Jax. Would you say hi? Say hi. All right, so order glasses. Doing that now so I don't forget. All right, you guys. I just cleaned almost the whole house in like three hours. It's been a little while. I probably look like I've been cleaning the house for like three hours. I can't see what you guys are seeing. I don't know. Stop, Jax. I don't know if you've seen. He's like trying to paw at my hand because he thinks I'm like trying to pet him. So he's going like that to my hand. <laughs> but the GoPro, the lens is like that big. But there's like a space around it like that big. And then the actual GoPro is only like this big. So in the little area like this, I can kind of see a tiny bit of my reflection. So for some reason, 
I'll kind of look in it a little bit and do this, but no, I can't actually see anything. So I probably just made that worse. But anyways, <laughs> I cleaned most of the house. I still have Ireland's bedroom to do. Sorry, I just realized my arm was like sliding down. <laughs> I have uh, to check Ireland's room and help her with what she didn't do. And the laundry that I just washed to put away. Oh, I want you to look at this. I bought these pillows. I'm going to be doing a living room. Uh, I have one more piece of furniture in here that I'm going to be painting. And then like a, not really a redecorate with me, but show you a few things that I'm going to be putting up and stuff. So I bought myself a Radon pillow. Wouldn't you know, right there and right there. There's dog hair all over it and my child got chocolate in two spots already. But I have your note. I did find I wanted gray to kind of tie in the house with a brown couch because the brown couch didn't really match as well as what we were really looking for. But it is the most comfortable couch that we've ever owned. So I'm really glad that we got it. But at TJ Maxx, I found these gray pillows. I don't know how well you can see that, sorry. Awkward angle. But these gray pillows that have these brown buttons on it that are literally the same exact color as the couch. They are perfect. It was $20 for two. And then I don't remember how much the Ray Dunn pillow was. I didn't care. I probably would have sold my shoes that I was wearing to buy it because I have problems, I guess. But <laughs> it, it was like $10. It wasn't expensive. <laughs> and I've got some other stuff that I've done in here. I changed up the decor on the coffee table and stuff. But you'll see that in that video. Well, my husband just said he'll be home probably in about an hour. Well, how long ago did he say that actually? Yes, yeah, so it'll probably be about 30, 45 minutes now. Um, well, he'll be done in about 30, 45 minutes. So he'll be home in about an hour. Um, not sure what his plans are. Not sure what he wants to do, but he said he wanted to do something. So I guess, so sorry. I did not drink coffee this morning and I'm starting to feel it, so I'm probably gonna go make one, but um, I don't remember what I was saying now. Anyways, I'm not sure what he wants to, wants to do, so I'm going to go check Ireland's room, make sure she's doing what she needs to be doing, and fold a couple loads of laundry while I wait pick something to wear other than my comfortable around the house clothes because you know at this point I'm not sure what we're going to be doing so <laughs> I don't know but I'm going to go get that stuff done and yeah we'll see what else we're going to get into today the doctor that we found is one that actually cares <laughs> about what's going on and will actually get some help and some answers from this one Lord willing so we are going to head on out here and traffic is really bad so I don't want to be too distracted but um we're gonna head out here and I will let 
let you all know what all's going on once we get there. Hello everyone. We are on our way back from Grandma's house. Um, we took her to what I thought was a neurology appointment. Come to find out, it is a memory loss research thing. Uh, <laughs> the guy was not a doctor. We did not see a doctor. He just tested her memory loss and then told her that if she chooses to participate in the research study, then she can get an infusion of some random named drug once a month for a year. And he wrote down the name of said drug for me to research. So I typed in the name when we left. I took her out to lunch and while she was eating, I looked it up. And everything said that for the first 12 months of it, there's been no sign of it working. So essentially, and I also thought that she just looked up neurologists and found this doctor. Well, once we got in there, I found out that she wasn't telling the truth that she found him on Facebook and called them or filled out some questionnaire on Facebook and then they called her. Um, so, I mean, we're not out anything or anything like that, but it's not an appointment that <laughs> she needs. So luckily, at least tomorrow, the doctor that we're going to is a legitimate primary care physician. That doctor. And hopefully we will get some help and answers from there that we need. So far, her current doctor is doing nothing and this doctor was a wash, essentially. So, it is about 4 p.m. already. I've been at her house all day today because we went early to help her get ready and then we were there and then took her to lunch and came back and hung out for a little bit so yeah kind of got my hands full here so I'm just gonna run home clean up start dinner I'm pretty sure the recipe that I have for today is an instant pot meal which makes things a lot easier and then uh, we'll get a little bit of work done with YouTube stuff, get uh, some stuff figured out for tomorrow, and then by that point it'll probably be bedtime at this point. It's already well, a quarter after four already, so not too exciting of a day. We are back home, you guys. I am about to start dinner. Um, I'm going to show you the recipe real quick. Easy to be read. Um, it is called the Low Carb Chicken Divan. Go. It's got chicken breast, cauliflower rice. I think that's it. I am about to start that. I am actually editing today's video. Monday's video is going up pretty late because we were at grandma's kind of late, but I also am going to go ahead and edit this so I can get it uploaded so it posts tomorrow morning so you guys get your video on time tomorrow and then tomorrow I have the video that I'm going to be um, filming when I get home already planned out, which is great. I'm excited. Um, it's about almost 6.40. So I am going to get things cleaned up and dinner started before he gets here so I can get that taken care of. So I think I'm going to go ahead and wrap this one up and yeah, I think that's it. Give it a big thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe if you'd like to and we will see you in tomorrow's video. Bye guys.
We are back home, you guys. I am about to start dinner. Um, I'm gonna show you the recipe real quick. Sorry if my handwriting is not very easy to be read. Um, it is called the Low Carb Chicken Divan. Oh, it's got chicken breast, cauliflower rice. I think that's it. Broccoli, cheddar, all that good stuff. Here, I don't know if I showed you that part. Sorry for the uh, shadow again. The lighting is terrible. I am about to start that. I am actually editing today's video. Monday's video is going up pretty late because we were at grandma's kind of late, but I also am gonna go ahead and edit this so I can get it uploaded so it posts tomorrow morning. So you guys get your video on time tomorrow. And then tomorrow I have the video that I'm gonna be um, filming when I get home already planned out, which is great. I'm excited. Um, it's about almost 6.40. Um, my husband is going to be on his way home in a few minutes because he actually just called and said he has a really bad toothache and his face is starting to swell so I need to get him taken care of and then get him to a dentist in the morning to get that taken care of. And then please let me finish my video, okay? So I am going to get things cleaned up and dinner started before he gets here so I can get that taken care of. So I think I'm going to go ahead and wrap this one up. I will try to insert a clip of dinner when it's done. If I have time, if it's finished while I'm still editing, I'll throw one in there. If not, check my Instagram at Offbeat Mama Saga and I'll post a picture there. So keep an eye out for that. And yeah, I think that's it. Give it a big thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe if you'd like to. And we will see you in tomorrow's video. Bye guys.